Soberling. Thank you for being here. <laughs> We have a very feisty Carrie today. That's how I like to see you, Carrie. All right, now let's get to our first movie, which is by Zach. Now, with the stakes even higher than ever before, what does Zach have in store for us this week? Well, why don't we find out, right? Check it out. Stay by for rehearsal. My film this week is called Bonus Feature, and it's about a guy who's trying to impress a girl. <laughs> the kind of stories I love to tell are kind of modern-day fantasy films. Oh, you guys look at each awesome. other, look back, lasers fly. We're doing uh, some stuff with green screen, and the way that works is basically you tell the computer, take away everything that's green and replace it with whatever you want. Look back, like I need to see you seeing the spaceship behind you. <laughs> One of the fun things for the audience is that I'm referencing and paying homage to classic films that I grew up with. Right now we're filming our galaxy far, far away scene. <laughs> There's a danger because I'm referencing some classic films that I'll just be branded as someone who's duplicating them. We're now down to the final six, and there's no more hiding in other groups, and we're basically just here to give everything we can to stay week by week, because these are the toughest weeks we've ever had. Cut, nice. Here's Zach's movie, the bonus feature. It's got a phone. I can plug my iPod in. Yeah, and uh, it's, it's got a place ah, for your water. Hey, water. And my dad got me the bonus DVD player. So you're gonna watch movies while you drive? Mm -hmm. No, no, no. It's so that maybe me and a, and a friend can drive somewhere, watch movies, see what happens. That sounds great. So what do you just press this button or? Hey, chicken, you're gonna lose. Huh? No, no, I, I, I don't wanna race you. I'm so sorry. I, I, I didn't know. My dad bought the DVD player. I, I just wanted to show you the car. I had no idea this would happen. It's okay. I don't have my bathing suit. Where we're going, we don't need bathing suits. think you're such a great, you know, filmmaker. Um, I felt this, though, was more a ride than a, a film. Yeah. You know, there wasn't that much character or story to it. It was incredible visually, which I know you can do. But at this point, I sort of, well, I want more from you in terms of just story and stuff. But, right. you know, you always do it for me, Zach. Thank so <laughs> just do better next time. I yeah. will. <laughs> Zach, I think you are a tremendous skill set in search of your inner storyteller. I mean, I, I, every great romance needs obstacles, and I, I think the homage work is incredible. You have wonderful facility, but we just got to marry you to a good writer. I think we got to yeah. find that storytelling uh, spark. For sure. Thanks. I think you always surprised me, Zach. Here I was a little surprised where you were going. It wasn't exactly romantic. It wasn't exactly comedy. Yeah. You homaged the different director. I wasn't sure it was an homage or you were sucking up to Spielberg. <laughs> but whatever. <laughs> I, I think you're a wonderful <laughs> filmmaker, and I certainly hope you continue here on our show. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, yeah. All right, America. 
Monica, if you want to keep Zach on the lot, vote for him by calling 188, the lot 01. That's 1-888-435-6801. Verizon Wireless subscribers can text the word vote to 6801, or you can always go to thelot.com and vote there. But remember, don't do anything until the end of the show or your votes will not count.